Kate Stark. And I'm Angela Lobemeyer. And welcome back to your daily video announcements. Today for lunch, we have taquitos, Frito salad, cheesy corn bake, frozen treat, and a cold milk. Let's take a look at today's holidays. Next, let's take a quick glance at your top five news stories of the day. Hi, my name's Kyle, and this is top five news stories. Catalytic converter theft increasing across the country in 2022. Walmart ended cigarette sales at some of its locations. Will Smith apologizes to Chris Rock. I was out of line. NFL launches committee to review diversity hiring policies. Donald Trump says he scored a hole-in-one at his resort. Let's take it to hot ones. Good morning, Valley Center. Welcome to Hot Ones, Episode 2. I am your host, Dayton Basto, and today I am joined with... Evan McCartney. All right, awesome. So, without further ado, we're just going to jump into it. Uh, mm -hmm. First, I want to introduce our sauces. Uh, first, on the like the lowest scale, is the classic hot sauce. And then we have n the Los Calientes with a 5 out of 10, and I think this one has apricot in it. And then the hottest, we have Apollo Last Ab. This is the hottest that Hot Ones makes, as far as I'm aware. So, Evan, your first question. Mm -hmm. What are you most excited for about the trap team? Ooh, um, state. State? That's th most definitely the state competition at the end of the year. Um, every team gets together from our region, which is most of Kansas, and we all get together and shoot, and it's, it's a grand old time. Grand old time. Grand right. old time. First wing. Ooh. That's just a good sauce. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's no heat to that. Nope. Yeah, I definitely love the flavor on that one. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Too easy. Now, uh, second question. As a person who plays the guitar, what's a song you wish you knew how to play? Um, Freebird, in its entirety, by Leonard Skinner. I do like that song. That's a good classic song. It's classic it's just too song. cool. It's too cool. Too cool. All right, so, second sauce. Second sauce. Again, no heat, just a really good sauce. It almost reminds me of, like, a barbecue. It'll catch up in a second. But I, I figure so. I'm scared for this one, man. You go right. <laughs> All right. What can you tell me about your Hornet highlights solo? Ooh, um, we can all go not a whole demo. lot, because it's gonna be cool, and I'd rather you just come see it. Fair enough. But um, it's just a really, it's a really emotional song. But it's it's a very good song. We like simple hair. I don't think that was a dab. I, that don't. It's more of a swab. Mm, yeah. All right, Just well, a little bit. Let's go ahead and get it then. Three, two, one, go. Mm. No. Not yeah. bad. Give it a second. This one's just no flavor. All yeah, pain. just all heat. It's yeah, all there's pain. just no flavor to that sauce at all. That's bad. All right, well, without further ado, I guess we can just go ahead and end the show. Evan, thank you for joining me today on mm -hmm. Hot Ones, and we'll see you guys next time. Now, a Butler Community College announcement. Next, Tanganyika Wildlife Park announcement. Now, for a blood drive announcement. 2015, playing versus Youngstown State, hitting the leg. So y'all know something isn't right on my, my right knee. And he tell me I tore my MCL. Doc looks me in my eyes and he says, you're out for the season. Surgery was good, surgery was a success. And I'm rehabbing for that, I'm running. As I'm doing all this, I'm having all these different type of symptoms. So I'm like, you know, what's going on? So I go get the x-ray on my chest. The doctor calls me and he said, James, we, it's looking like a form of lymphoma. And I'm like, lymphoma, what, what do you mean? Like, what's that? You gotta make a decision right there. How you gonna respond? That's basically what it comes down to. I said, let's go. I remember sitting in a chair like this and it was in like these big syringe tubes and they were like yeah it can't you know can't get on their skin and whatnot I'm like I'm thinking to myself it can't get on the skin but they were to you know put it in me you know but that just shows like what type of monster chemo is you know it's real real tough 12 rounds I believe people can help cancer patients fight back by donating blood and just realizing how important that is about six blood products are needed every minute of every day to help someone going through a cancer treatment. 
Yet only 3% of American public donates blood in a given year. And so, but after it was over, you know, you ring that bell, you wait for the results, and they call. And uh, over like a thousand pounds lifted off my shoulders. And they said I was clean. We can all do our part to help ensure our loved ones have the strength and support to fight cancer by donating blood. Give blood to give time. Let's head on over to weather. Today's high is 51 degrees, and today's low is going to be 33 degrees. Now, for a quick blast to the past, let's wrap up this day in history. Stay classy, BC. March 30th, 1981. <laughs> Outside a Washington hotel, John Hinckley Jr. shoots President Ronald Reagan and three others. Presidential aide Lynn Nofziger. The president has been shot once in the left chest. The bullet entered from, from his left side. The shooting seriously injures Reagan early in his presidency and permanently disables his White House press secretary, James Brady. 1867. Secretary of State William Seward reaches a deal with Russia to buy the territory of Alaska. At the time, critics ridiculed the $7.2 million purchase as Seward's folly. 1986. You're a grand old flag, you're a high-flying flag, and forever in peace may you wait. Actor James Cagney, known for his movie Tough Guy roles, dies at his farm in upstate New York at age 86. Cagney won an Oscar for playing Broadway legend George M. Cohan in the...